What made you decide to get dreadlocks? Well, I have been natural for like three years, and I got tired of having to deal with my hair. And I started seeing locks, and I was like, do I really, really want it? And sooner or later, I just took a chance and I got them, and I loved it because it's the fact that it's a part of me, it's a part of my culture. So not only am I showing off my personality, I'm able to show where I'm from. Where I come from. Strong in my family, you know. Um, everybody in my family has, almost everybody in my family has dreads. Um, they had it for quite a while, and in the, in the, in the, and I wanted to do something like because I looked up to them. Um, it was inspiring to get dressed. Um, it, it had a sense of power to it to me. So, you know, I want to associate myself with that. Basically, to me, they represent a lot. Like since growing them out, I've been through a lot. So, um, I've lost some friends, family members. They kind of, they kind of tell the story. So. If anything, I have to say that's about all that they mean to me. It's just here, it'll come back if I cut them off. So. I think it was a, a easier hairstyle than most. Like, I, I kind of like the aspect of being able to wake up in the morning and just throw my hair. To me, it signifies, you know, your, your experiences in life. You know what I'm saying? As they get longer, you can tell a story with me. Well, I grow my dreads because I'm my own person. You see, I got the color in them. See, it's different. A lot of people use their locks as their strength. And mine's represent the strength and how far I'm going in life and wisdom that I've learned. Well, I've tried so many different hairstyles and I really just feel like this really fits me. Like, it's me. I can't see myself with anything else but dreads. Well, I decided to get dressed to get in touch with my roots. I felt like it was a beautiful thing. I don't like how people say, uh, or try to define dreads as being a thug. I just got tired of the whole looking like everybody else and I knew it would set me apart from other people. It just means a lot. It's, it's mine. It just makes me happy. I never looked at mine as dreadful. They were always beautiful. I like them. You know what I'm saying? So they've just been locks to me. and There's nothing dreadful about my hair. But in actuality, there are a lot of philosophers and other people in higher areas who had dreads. So, you know, it's just a, a society of negativity that goes on. I don't see anything negative about it. Who you are is who you are without the dreads or with, with the dreads. I'm going to still be the same person I am. I feel like people put a negative stigma to it, but on um, the reality of it, it's, it's not negative about having dreads.